Hey you guys, thank you for joining me for another video today. Uh, I wanted to make this video for targeted individuals, people that are being targeted by the government, by the Illuminati, New World Order, whatever you want to call them, uh, with directed energy weapons, chemtrails, mind control, stalking, breaking into our homes, mail tampering, uh, the, list, the list goes on, okay? It's some pretty sick stuff that our governments are doing to us right now. In, in the year 2013 but anyways I wanted to make this video um, I want to just tell you guys in a quick video as much stuff that I know that's gonna help you from fighting them okay one thing is gonna be hematite rings I know that you have seen me wear these um, hematite grounds you and it absorbs negative energy onto itself I remember when I first tried one on I had a lot of negative energy in my genitalia area and it sucked it up right onto itself and, and I literally felt it move from there into the ring and I was amazed and I was like wow that, that's awesome and that was just one and then what they started doing is they, the one ring that I was wearing they started attacking the ring with the directed energy I felt it because it was burning on my finger when because that's how much they hated it because it was protecting me that well so I bought many when you buy many there's really nothing they can do at that point um, also hematite bracelets I wear the bracelets as well excellent for protection from direct energy weapons and it grounds you grounds you to the earth when you're grounded to the earth it's harder for these um, these dark forces that are attacking us it's for harder for them to attack you and get to you when you're grounded on the earth okay that's important to know um, secondly is whenever you go to sleep at night don't sleep with the light off sleep with the light on your aura heals light heals your aura or the light heals you we're light beings so when you go to sleep at night and they're attacking you all night with direct energy weapons and you have the light off your aura gets smaller and smaller and smaller your chakras get smaller and smaller and smaller until it's completely diminished and that's what they want because that's when sickness and disease can set in so when you sleep at night, sleep with the light on you. If you're concerned about your electricity bill, what I would do is get the energy efficient bulbs and you know, put that over you and, and sleep with that on. That's gonna help you a lot. Um, third, create yourself positive affirmations. I made a video on it, okay? Um, your thoughts, your emotions, and your feelings were creator beings okay we create our day-to-day -day life and experience we are creating that um, and this that's what this whole thing is about is your parts of your body and your physiology are changing and you're waking up you're coming into consciousness and they see this and they don't want you to come into consciousness they want to stop stop you from coming into consciousness so it's too late <laughs> I'm already there and I'm trying to help you guys get there um, but once you learn that, you learn that you're actually in control of your life and that your thoughts, your feelings and emotions are creating your day to day experience. And that's hence the mind control. The mind control, if, they, if they, what they're thinking is if we can control your mind, if we can control your thoughts, your feelings and your emotions, then we can control you. We can control your day to day experience. We can control the earth because if you can control all of mankind's mind, we can control the earth because it's all of our minds together the universal mind of God is all of our minds together that create our reality here on earth that create the experience that we're having the wars that we're having all the pain the distress the hunger the, the all the crap the, the negative things that are going on on this earth we're creating it with our own mind our thoughts our feelings our emotions we're creating these things but it's not fair because they're using mind control to control everybody's minds causing these things to happen so that's why it's so imperative that you come into consciousness and you realize that it's your minds your thoughts your feelings your emotions that are creating your, your day to day experience you can have whatever you want you can do whatever you want you can go wherever you want you just have to learn that it's you that can create it and they want to stop you from doing that so that's the most important thing you need to learn you need to learn that you need to create your positive affirmations to create the kind of life that you want you know I am divine love and I am abundance and money and wealth and success they're all attracted to me you know I am perfect health and I and I am healthy at all times nothing can harm me um, 
I am divine love and not, you can just say I am divine love and nothing in creation can harm me. I am positive life force energy and only positive things happen in my life. Negative circumstances and situations do not happen in my life anymore. Negative circumstances and situations do not happen in my life anymore. And you have to change all your thoughts have to be positive like that daily. If you can do that, you'll see your whole life will change. You have everything in your life that you ever wanted, you ever dreamed of, your dreams to come true. Um, this is what they don't want. They don't want you figured out. And you know what the thing is? Is they have no control. They have absolutely no control. Once you figure it out, that's it. And you just don't fear them. You just don't fear them. And they have they have absolutely no control. There's nothing that they can do. Because this whole thing, that's that's what this whole thing was set up for. It's just a game of consciousness. It was for us to come down here and forget consciousness and return to it. And to return to it. And that's what's happening now. That's what the whole thing the whole thing is, is about. And uh, no reason to fear them. They're just a player in the game and they have absolutely no power. So that's another thing I can tell you. Um, Let's see what else I can tell you that's going to help you. Uh, keeping a lot of Oregon, you know, on you and around you is going to help you because Oregon is positive energy. It's the complete opposite of the negative dark energy that's being sent to you. Um, if you see my videos, I've, rec I've made a video on spiritual warfare prayers. There are spiritual warfare prayers that are specifically... Um, for what we're going through and I put a link and I made a video and that's out there if you say those spiritual warfare prayers you're basically creating a life for yourself where you'll be free from all attacks um, see what else I can tell you you know you need to you need to become a loving person you need to become love because the new world order the Illuminati that's what um, is their weakness love is their weakness they hate love they hate people being loved loving to each other um, that's truly what our power is is love and unity when we all come together and we realize that there's no white there's no black there's no Chinese there's no Iraqi there's no Afghanistan that we're just all one race of beings and that we're all one body of God and that we're all one mind and once we come together in this unity is is really when we're going to defeat the new world order and once we also realize that we're all love you know you have to become a loving person you have to do loving things it's it's a process of changing yourself from what they created us to be which is what like them they want us to be like them that's how they that's how we grew up with the crap we watched on TV and the, the mind control and the brainwashing and all the things that they did is they wanted to make us like them. But we have to change that. We have to become love, which is the opposite of them. Their fear. Okay, if you could if there was a if there was a definition I could give you of what they are, their fear. And fear stands for false evidence appearing real. That's all it is. False evidence appearing real. So those are uh, some things I can share with you guys. I think that's going to help you. Um, also, just a good thing you could do is get involved in the crystals and stones, learning about them, because different crystals and stones are made from different minerals, which can actually protect you from directed energy and which can expand your consciousness. The crystals are alive and they're intelligent and they share information with you. Um, they help you become smarter. Um, they heal you. They do amazing, great things in your life, crystals and stones. You'd be, you'd be amazed. Like black obsidian uh, was made from lava, you know, lava hardened rock that has hardened by lava and it's black. And because of that process that it went through, negative energy cannot co coexist around that stone. It just simply cannot coexist. So when you're holding one in your hand or you have some in your room, it, it helps to, you know, and not allow the negative energy in your room or in or into your body so that's just one of the examples of the many great stones that there are that there that can help you we only have a little bit of time left i just wanted to share as much information with you as i could in one quick video i love you guys you know we're all in this together to help one another just to remember that we're love and and to unite and to unite all over the earth because that's truly how we're going to defeat them i love you bye